240 uh, volt root mean square voltage okay uh, root mean square voltage supply okay so this one uh, root mean square supply okay this one means uh, root mean square source voltage okay so this is a vrms source okay vrms source um, with frequency of 50 hertz okay this one give us the frequency oh, sorry this one give us the frequency uh, and then uh, causes a root mean square current of 3 ampere okay this is a root mean square current so this is a uh, uh, IRMS to flow through an inductor okay this is you have inductor which is taken to be a zero resistance okay so you have a inductor L uh, Resistance is zero. Okay, seems like this circuit only has inductor. Okay, so it is a, a pure uh, inductor circuit. Okay, it's a pure inductor circuit. Uh, no capacitor, no resistor. And uh, now the question asks for reactance of the inductor. So this is the XL. Huh? It asks for XL. And inductor of the inductor so inductance is big L okay so he asked for sorry, uh, yeah so he asked for uh, this uh, this is the big L huh? so he asked for the big L okay uh, so this is a pure inductor capacitor a pure inductor circuit and the root mean square source voltage is uh, 240 volt information here uh, the root mean square source voltage because it got a word supply means source. Okay, uh, 240 volt, and because it's a pure inductor uh, circuit, so uh, the source voltage is parallel to the inductor. So we can say uh, VRMS source will be equal to VRMS L. Uh, so the VRMS source 240 volt is also equal to VRMS L. Okay, VRMS L because it is a pure inductor circuit. Uh, so they are uh, the source and the inductor equal voltage. Okay, uh, same voltage because they are parallel. Okay, because the inductor is the only component there. Now uh, we also have the root mean square current. Okay, now he asked for the ca uh, inductive reactance. So how to do? Uh, we already have the VRMS L and also the IRMS. So we can use the formula VRMS L equal to IRMS XL. Uh, when VRMS, I also RMS. Okay. Uh, uh, so uh, when VL, uh, VL, so this one also XL. Okay. So we substitute uh, the uh, 240 volt here and IRMS is 3 uh, so XL is um, 80 ohm okay 80 ohm so we got the uh, inductive reactance next is the inductance okay inductance we already have the inductive reactance so just use the formula of inductive reactance which is XL equal to omega L Okay, uh, so uh, omega uh, is 2 pi f. Okay, we have f here. Okay, so just substitute the frequency and the... Uh, okay, we have the xl here. Okay, uh, we want to find l. So our l is 0 0.255 Henry. Uh, so this is the unit. So inductive reactance, the unit is ohm, but inductance, the unit is Henry.